tell you I have reignited my love affair with cognac. I love, love cognac. But last week, I realized that um, I was missing out on cognac cocktails. So uh, give you a little background. Last week, I attended a virtual event. It was hosted by an organization, a movement called the Cognac Connection. The Cognac Connection, their goal is to educate uh, those in the trade about Cognac. And they have a really cool program going on right now. So they are awarding a ten one thousand dollar gift um, or scholarships to bartenders. So go to the cognacconnection.com, share the initiative with your favorite bartender, and help them make some money. Okay. So as I mentioned, um, I realized that I was not um, like making cognac cocktails. I would drink cognac with a cigar at night with one of my hanging out with one of my guy friends uh usually in the winter or in the fall sometimes in the summer and sitting there watching this uh virtual event i was inspired so okay i had to pull up my notes i'm going to make a cocktail for you um miss frankie marshall who was the um hostess for this event uh, the moderator is a better word and uh, she taught us this recipe. So I'm using the Bosch Grit Gabrielson uh, VS Cognac. So VS means if you don't know that the youngest eau de vie in the bottle has to be two years old. Now if you want some more information about VS, VSOP and other styles of Cognac, check out uh, our blog shallrewind.com. I posted it yesterday. And I basically compiled a lot of the notes uh, and a lot of the information that I picked up from this event and I shared it on the blog. So, you know, I always recommend that you pour a little bit first, not for the ancestors, but, or the homies, but just to taste it. So, mm, this is so yummy. So I call this my, uh, one of my PYTs, pretty young thing. It's young, it's fresh, it's round, it's got some nice sweetness to it, and it holds up beautifully in this cocktail. Okay, so you can basically build this cocktail in your glass. I am going to fill it up with ice. Um, lots of ice, because this is really a yummy, yummy summer cocktail. Okay, so we're going to do one and a half ounces of uh, cognac. VS. Oops, I just did two ounces. What is, I have been having a strange day. Okay, so I'm gonna do two ounces because obviously I need it. All right, so then we're gonna do two ounces of coconut water. All right, so I've used coconut water for my um, mocktails, but this is the first coconut water cocktail that I've used. And then we're gonna do two ounces of um, sparkling water. And I really like this one. I don't think I've ever talked about it, but I use it a lot, Topo Chico, so two ounces. Now, when we made this cocktail last week, Miss Frankie suggested a little bit of simple syrup. And I agree, I think it needs it. I'm only going to do about a fourth of an ounce though of simple syrup. So we're going to stir it up. <laughs> All right, so we're stirring it up. And then this particular cognac, this Bosch Gabrielson, I get a little bit of uh, orange peel. So I think orange is a great um, complement. Uh, so this is a good garnish. You can use whatever citrus you want. Okay, this is yummy. It's a summer cocktail. It's a great way to explore cognacs. Uh, enjoy. Cheers, everybody.